Hey internet, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a choir box unboxing video for you, but unlike my usual unboxings, it's gonna be a little similar to the one that I did for Zenpop, in which I'm gonna be doing double month. I'm just trying to play some catch up so the unboxings are not super delayed. So this one here, I think it's, this is the May box, but the one you're gonna see next is the April box. And then when we're done unboxing that, we will come back right here to do the May box. So yeah, let's get into the April box. And this is the April box. All right, okay. I feel like the Kawaii boxes are usually like a month delayed for me. Um, same for Simply Gilded, but the Zempa boxes are really on time. Maybe it's because Australia is just closer to Japan. Um, sweet Sakura picnic. Oh, okay. I'm excited to see what sort of goodies we've got this time around. Oh, cute. Look at all the pink. Um, so first up we have a water bottle, which is very functional and useful. But yes, how cute is this? It's such a cute water bottle. Um, and I think it's just, yeah, just a twist top. And there's a little bit of filtering here. I mean, not proper filtering, but you know what I mean. Just makes drinking a little easier so you don't have like the entire water bottle land on you. But that is so cute. Next to all these like adorable pencils. So many pencils. And they're Sanrio, okay. And we have a pen, which I'll try at the end, but... Oh, this is also Sanrio thing. I'm actually kind of impressed with all the Sanrio now. Um, but it looks to be a pen, yeah, and it has a little My Melody trinket on the end. So uh, not the best for writing, but it's very cute. Um, and then we have a little... Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Um, I'm guessing this is like a Shiba, but like a pink Shiba. And then the Shiba has a bunch of mochi on its head. That's very cute. I think this is like candy. Oh, it's like chocolate. Which way is it? Chocoboru. Peanutsu. All right, so peanuts with chocolate. And then we have a ton of cool washi tape. Look at all that. I'm not going to take it out of the box because I think it's actually pretty clear on camera. Usually washi tape comes in like plastic, which makes it harder to see, but this is pretty clear. Then we have some sticker sheets, and then yeah, that's it. All right, so sticker sheets. Fortunately, both of them are like 3D-ish, so they're not very good for planners, but they're very good for decorating. That's what I've been using all my 3D leftover stickers for, is like decorating the outside of things, presents, envelopes, anything. This one's really cute because it's got a bunch of Shiba. This is probably my preferred. And this is more like, I'm assuming you could use this for like decorating what well, says phones. Yeah, phones or cases or books and stuff like that. And yeah, that is pretty much it. So let's quickly try this pen. Okay, so I'm just gonna try this pen. I don't think this is any particular brand, to be honest. It's just a san standard Sanrio pen, so. Um, let's see. Ooh, it's really nice though. It's a gel black pen. Um, and it's a 0.5, that's my take. But it actually feels really nice. So smooth, I love it. If it just didn't have this thing, I might actually just take this off and then keep using the pen because I really like this pen. It's really good. Um, it's weird because if you ever go to Japan um, to Puro Land and there's like this huge section of just a bunch of merchandise, I guess it's the gift shop for Puro Land, and you can get a lot of great stationery there. And I don't think the stationery is branded. It's not like Pentel or Pilot or anything. It's just caricatured pens like this. And I've gotten some of my favorite pens from there like a Pachaco pen, etc. So I don't know. I don't know what they're using. Maybe they are using a branded one and they're just not t announcing it, but I really love it. All right, now that we've done the April box, let's get into May. I'm pretty sure it's, yes, it's May. I was like talking about the months at the start. I'm like, I really hope I'm, uh, I really hope I have the months right. So this is happy birthday box. I wonder if this is because, oh, it's the seventh anniversary for Kawaii box. That's kind of cool. So first up, we have a sticker. Oh yeah, it's like a bunch of stickers, but I wonder if it's like a dispenser. That's why it's kind of teared up like this. Let me just figure this out. All right, so I just opened this, which was kind of like that. I think this is just more of a, a lid. And I think this must be like a roll. No, what am I talking about? Oh, okay, it is stickers, but it's gum as well. I should have just read the little pamphlet to the side. So yeah, you get 
some gum, which I love gum, so this is very exciting. And then you get a couple stickers as well. Smiku Gurashi stickers. This is so cute. And then we've got some badges here, which not totally my taste, but very cute. Um, got a pen here, but we can try it at the end um, and just see what it's like. Looks like a ballpoint pen potentially. Yeah. Oops. And then we have, oh, so we have this really cute notebook. Um, I don't really know these characters. I don't know if they're like known or anything like that, um, but they're very quirky. He says Yurui here, which is, I guess, like gentle or loose, gentle, so I'm, I guess in this sense his skin or his outer layer is very loose, that's why he's just hanging off the branch. But we've got this one here for the design, and then we have another one here. So he keeps saying Yurui and Kawaii here. And then, looks like, oh wow, it's like an actual towel. Um, let me just open this, I'm curious to see how big this is. Okay, I've opened it up. I don't think I can show you the size of it on camera just because I don't have a lot of space here. But it is a pretty good hand towel. I would say that this is something that um, size-wise you could put maybe where you have hand towels in the bathroom. That's about the size. But it's this really cute design. Maybe I can just show you the design. It is the kawaii character, like the kawaii box character, so it's not like it's a... Um, Sanrio or anything like that, but it is really cute. Probably not for my bathroom aesthetics, but I'm going to keep it because I know plenty of people who would love this. And then we're moving on to some sticker flakes here. Oh, yeah. You can kind of see the different types of sticker flakes they have here. It looks like it's probably a paper version. Let me take it out. There's no point really just showing you the exterior because you can probably see that for yourself online. I think they're paper versions. There you go. Very cute. And you've got a bigger one here, but lots of little cute designs. Then we have a HB pencil. Um, I've, I don't think this is any particular character that I'm familiar with. I'll put that aside. And then lastly, this looks like a photo album, Doraemon album, document case is what it says. There we go. Okay, yeah, I mean, I would probably, you could put like receipts and stuff in here, but that's probably what it'd be used for. It'd be nice if it had some rings to it or something. I feel like that'd make it more versatile. So yeah, that is everything in May's Kawaii box. Let's go try that pen. Okay. Oh, it's a uh, gel. It's totally wrong. It's a black gel pen and it writes so nicely. This is what I'm saying. It's it's crazy because they're not, from what I can tell, they don't seem to be part of any, oops, almost dropped it there. They don't seem to be part of like an official Pentel pilot line, but the pen is really nice. I'm just gonna take the refill out and see if I can recognize it. Oh, you know what? It says mini soul. I don't know if you guys have a mini soul where you live. We have a couple popping up all over Melbourne, but they remind me of um, kind of like a Muji, but a more budget Muji. So maybe that's where all the ink's coming from. I should probably pop by mini soul and try out their pens. Maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll do a Minnesota's haul because I haven't actually checked out any of their stationery lines. Um, I usually just go there to buy different knickknacks for the kitchen, but maybe stationery too. Anyways, I digress. That is everything in both April and May's Kawaii box. Thank you so much for watching. This is Selena of Money in My Room. Back to you, internet. Mm -hmm.